for foggy conditions to greet the players when they arrive for the third day of the CJ Invitational, hosted by KJ Choi. But once it cleared, we got to get to completion of the second round. Ben Curtis played really well in that second round. And see more of the same when he rolled in this putt at the second to go to nine under par. But he did slip back after that to minus eight. Charlie Wee did get to finish his second round yesterday. And he had four birdies in his first six holes to take him to nine under. A late bogey before Light beat him. He's at eight under par now. Lee Dong Hwan opened up with a 66 on day one. 72 for him in round two. Saw him slip back, but he went motoring up the leaderboard once again. Five unanswered birdies. Terrific shot here at the sixth. And he is right now at nine under. Kim Dae Hyun, big hitting Karina will be a popular winner. You can hear the screams as uh, he rolls in a putt there. He's got to 10 under par now. KJ Choi, though, probably would be the most popular winner of them all. Of course, the host, the defending champion, 10 under at the start of the day, slipped back in his second round, but he got things going again in his third round. This was his tee shot at the long par 3 8. It was an absolute beauty. And he followed it with a birdie here with another at the ninth. And he's got himself to 11 under par with nine holes still to play of his third round. And that takes him to within one shot of the leader. Still leading the way as he was heading in to the third round is Chinarat Budungsin of Thailand. 23-year-old, youngest ever winner on the Asian Tour. Look at this one. This was at the third. Real bonus birdie. Started his round at 10 under. That took him to 11 under par, and he played some absolute terrific recovery shots at the end. He leads by one, heading into day four.